What's up guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the fight between Doom and Thanos in the Secret War comics, issue 8 to be exact. This is the first time I'm actually covering a comic book fight in like just in a video. I've probably covered a lot of them, but not as the main topic of a video. So I'm just going to be covering this very fight. Also, this video will be short because this fight was very short. But you're probably already seeing this or anything, but it's still fun. And if you haven't, you need to listen to this because, yeah, it's a big part. But anyways, let's get started. Before we start, there are things you need to remember. So, this is from the second Secret World event, not the first one. This is from the 2015 one where Dr. Doom was the villain. And this is the perfect time because Dr. Doom is actually reported to be the villain of the Secret World movie coming out later with Jonathan Banks, or what I don't remember his name, being dropped. Personally, I like him as Kang, I love him as Kang, and I don't want to be dropped, but I love Doctor Doom way more than Kang. So, who knows? But anyways. So, Doctor Doom became God Emperor Doctor Doom because of the Beyonders stealing his power, or not, he stole the Beyonders' power, and obviously took over Battleworld, where it was just a world with a on many different universes combined into one world created and yeah he basically took over it made an army of thors that's also a fun fact and yeah became it emperor a god emperor to do doom on the other hand thanos was in the group that was actually trying to kill dr doom or stop him and in this fight which you're going to start talking about now so basically thanos was and his friends, or not friends, this group were trying to stop Dr. Doom. Thanos saw Dr. Doom kill people, and he jumped in, like, enough to confront Dr. Doom, because Thanos is really cocky in this, but he confronted him, and they talk. Doom, he basically makes a deal with Thanos, saying, I can spare you if you give me your loyalty. So if you work for me, you'll be basically his slave, or where he just uses him to beat a bunch of people. He basically says, work for me, be my, be loyal to me, and I will spare your life. Thanos doesn't really like that, and was basically like, I was a god, I wielded the infinity gauntlet, you're nothing, I was the real god, you're a fraud, you're a liar, you can't do nothing to me. You are a weak god, a pretender. Ending it with saying, it should be you who bows before me, talking to Dr. Doom. And Dr. Doom obviously asks just a simple ask question, do you have the Infinity Gauntlet now? Obviously Thanos doesn't have it, but being Thanos is very cocky and says, I don't need it to beat you, I can easily beat you without it. Uh, in seconds, Dr. Doom takes his hands, punches through Thanos, grabbing his spine and ripping it out, killing Thanos. And says basically, that will be untrue, showing him that he easily can defeat Thanos, obviously being with the, the, the powers of the Beyonder. Annihilus saw this thing and was really scared of Doctor Doom and became loyal to Doctor Doom just because he didn't want Doctor Doom to kill him because he was really scared that Doctor Doom did that to Thanos with little to no difficulty. But yeah, that's the end of the fight. That was very, very short, I know. Thanos didn't end a chance against God Emperor Doctor Doom. It would be a different fight. It was normal Doctor Doom versus Thanos. I can cover that maybe in a death battle or something. With obviously feats and what I think about it. But anyways, I'll see you all later. Goodbye.